Good. Good on my end. Mario, obviously not the result that you wanted tonight. Uh, what did you make of the match here? Well, we there were a couple of, of, of occasions where we're playing in their half, uh, especially that first penalty, and then there's a kickoff and they score a try from it. So it's almost a ten point differential. And then there's another one where we we have a very good chance. I don't know if it's scoring, but we have territory. We're building pressure. And we lose the ball, and it's a 70 meter try. So I just think that the, the first couple of tries were pretty easy for them. They didn't have to work a lot for them. Um, and then we started coming back. Uh, and at one point, we're 17 8. And we missed, at that point, we missed eight points with the, the kicking. Yeah. So it's difficult when you're running after the score and uh, well, you, you're not scoring. So. So those first two issues, do you put those, or those first two tries, do you put those down to uh, ill discipline on, on your end or, or sort of poor handling of the ball? Or? Yeah, we, we, we will have to look, look at it closely. But there's one definitely is poor handling, yeah. You seem to match the Wallabies tonight physically. They were very much, they knew it was going to be a, a physical contest out there. Do you think you executed the game plan effectively enough tonight, Julian or, or Mario? Or do you think you kind of strayed away from it at times when you got behind in the game? Yeah, as Mario said, I think that physically we were where we, where we wanted to be. Our line of the first half wasn't, wasn't good, and every, every time we, we defended about five meters with a good defense, they went to, they went to the ball, and we defended that, and then we go to a line that we lost the ball, and then we defended again. And I, as Mario said, they didn't work too much the first half to make so many points, and when you, you can't score, when you start to come back sort of at the back end of that first half and, and through the sort of early stages of the second half, could you feel the momentum swinging on the field? Yeah, yeah I think that when you, when you start going forward and you, you start scoring, the momentum is it's pretty easy to feel that you are, you are there. Then I think we need to, to, need to, score, to score more. And as I said, the, they didn't work too much to, to make those points in the first half. So once that you start running from the back, it's, it's, it's difficult to, to come back and come back again. But I'm proud of the team of the effort that, that we are bringing there. And we need to, to keep on working. Mario, you've got one more game in the Rugby Championship next week against Australia. What improvements do you want to see from your side before you tour the Northern Hemisphere after that? Well, we've, we've been trying to improve week in, week out. Um, and I think we did. We had a, a couple of uh, poor games at the beginning of the, of the championship, but the, the guys were coming back from, from holidays. And in, the, in their pre-season, they, they have to play the world champion. So it's, it's never easy. And I, and I think we, I'm pretty sure we're building uh, from week to week. And uh, one of the goals is to get better. And uh, it's pretty easy to put the finger on what, what didn't work tonight. So uh, we'll have um, a quiet beer tonight. Uh, there's one more week to go, and we're pretty excited to, to uh, challenge the, the Water Beast again next week. I believe you only had a couple of days or something like that before you played South Africa the first time to... But just a week. Yeah, just, just a week. So with, the, with some of the younger guys that you've got coming through, like Santiago Carreras, what have you made of his development as a fly half throughout the rugby championship, and is he showing promising signs moving forward as like your lock in? Most definitely, yeah. most definitely, and uh, I think even from last week to this week, his kicking game, and especially coming out of a fifty, was pretty good. He only missed once mm. when he, he he went for a fifty twenty, and uh, and he went straight into touch. But either that, uh, I think he's a triple threat, which is. It's pretty interesting. Mm. Any injuries from tonight that you might have concerns for? Not really. Not really, Not really just knocks. There was no concern. Uh, there was an incident in the first half of the HIA. Yeah, but he's, he's fine. He, he went through the HIA and he played the second half. So, yeah. so he passed protocols, everything yeah. was okay? Were you, were you watching? Or? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> we saw him come back out, just yeah. question. Yeah. Yeah, yeah um, you might have questions on, on Zoom.